My name is Chimmy Tsai. I'm the corresponding author of the article Liposome Encapsulated Photosynthesizers Against Bacteria. In this article, we overview the advantages of using liposomes in drug delivery and the value of using liposome encapsulated photosynthesizers in photodynamic therapy against bacteria. Liposomes have been used in the delivery of photosynthesizers for photodynamic therapy of cancers and photodynamic inactivation of pathogens such as bacteria and fungi. Since most photosynthesizers are hydrophobic in nature, they tend to aggregate in aqueous medium and result in reduced treatment efficacy. Using liposomes to encapsulate photosynthesizers may help resolve the aggregation problem of these easily aggregated photosynthesizers. Unlike those liposomes for anti-tumor purposes, where pegylated ones are generally preferred, for photodynamic activation of bacteria, pec-free liposomes are better than the pegylated ones since high rigidity of pegylated liposomes may interfere with the contact of target bacteria, hinder the release of photosynthesizers upon light activation, and reduce the PDD efficacy. There are more than 4,000 patents related to PDD issued by the USPTO, and most of them are for cosmetic, pharmaceutical, and therapeutic applications. Combining the search keywords of liposome, antimicrobial, and photodynamic therapy in clams we can only screen our 50 white patents. Using liposome encapsulated photosynthesizers against bacteria is not a popular issue yet, probably due to the complexity of combination therapy and also economic concern.